Shut up. Shut it. I need those batteries. Give them to me. Um, okay, badness is happening. Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Crashlands. So good to have you with us guys. So, last episode we started crafting up the new epic butterfly sword, and here it is. Check it out. Nice. Oh, this sucker is good. Look at that, 30 more damage, move speed increased, attacks uh, per second is the same, uh, crit chance, burn chance, turbo chance, this sucker is a major upgrade. Let's equip it. So there we go, we got the epic butterfly sword. I got something else crafting up here. We made uh, this guy, the D-Bot, which is a really cool item. I'm going to swap it out for, I guess I have to swap it out for one of these. So instead of these firecrackers, I guess I'm going to equip this guy. Now we have two health potions on our bar. I'm wondering if we should maybe swap it out for something else. Like, uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm a little torn about it. We could do a bomb. We could do a wrench. We could do a few different things. For right now, I guess I'm going to leave it with the two health potions. Because, you know, the whole motto here. Kill the bad guy and don't die. Well, it's pretty essential to the not dying part of things. We also have everything that we need to make this guy. The flingerang. So I think I want to start crafting that up which should be over here it is okay so I did a whole bunch of grinding off camera getting all these zug shells and yeah so we got that going and I ended up uh, also going for another boots and we got a purple boots as well guys so it has pretty good stats here and we got a full set of purple plus the orange helmet I think we're finally ready to go to high ground guys so let's take a look. Now we just started crafting up this flingerang and I'm not sure if we would replace anything we got with it because the interesting thing is if you look at all these weapons, for example, this does 100% of your DPS. The fire guy does 100% of your DPS. The flingerang does 100% of your DPS. They all do exactly the same damage. One does poison, one does fire, and the uh, flingerang does bleed. Now the the flamethrower is a little better than the um, poison one because instead of just doing one target, you can hit a whole bunch of guys at once, which is nice. So right here is high ground. I did a little bit of scouting ahead and got us a little closer so we're not still running forever. But guys, I think we might be here. It might be time to go take this guy on. Now, I have Tari with me, who I think is maybe still better than Reginald, but if we die, we might try out bringing Reginald with us just to, you know, try and get the best options here. I have no idea what to expect. But now we have this uh, little D-Bot guy. We should be able to be invincible for like a certain duration. That's exact. That's what it says anyway. We can use it and become invincible. So I think we're heading in the right direction. Although it was a pretty good sized little area that we had to explore here. Okay, so we're just now inside it. Where is this high ground? Here, high ground. Where are you? I don't even know what we're exactly looking for. But apparently there's going to be some kind of big bad fight. Okay, it is a pretty big area. Maybe it maybe it's at the top of it. That would maybe that would make sense, I guess. Or maybe it's right in the middle. Who knows? They've done a pretty good job for not making it that obvious where these things are. At least in my opinion. Oh dang. Oh snap, okay, can we get across here? Build mode? Nope, can't get into build mode. Huh, alright, let's not get hit by these zugs. Uh, can I come down here? I can't, man. Okay, we're gonna have to go all the way around this tar pit. Let's go down here and see if we can find this alleged high ground. Uh, how are we doing? Okay, we got like half of it explored. I guess we'll go around, just kind of wrap our way around. That seems like a good plan. Oh good, we found another teleporter, that's always nice. That way we don't have to, um... Actually, that makes me think that we're close. Are we really close to this thing? Okay, we can come through here, grab some of these. Um, let's see. Where are we at? Getting close. Man, I still don't see anything, guys. Where are you, Mr. High Ground? Lots of stuff that wants to kill me, that's for sure. 
Okay, where are you? Trying to find the high ground. Um, maybe it is all the way at the top? That might be a thing. Let's see if we can find it maybe all the way at the top. I don't want to pause, guys, because the thing will happen is I'll, I'll pause, you know, just to give you guys a break. You don't have to watch it all, and then instantly I'm going to find it. It's just how it goes, and I don't want you to miss any of the cutscenes or anything that's going to happen here. Okay, this looks a little... Oh, oh, okay, hold on. I think we found it. Okay, what do, what do we got here? We have some kind of... Um, big fortress well that's that's pretty hard to miss how the heck did we miss this okay we got a door right here um let's grab our flooring i guess we can build right over to it like this um can i not can i not get through this door is that not a thing okay weird um huh is this not the the high ground thing okay we're in here Maybe this isn't it. Like, you know before where I was like, oh, this must be it. And then it wasn't. Oh, what a jerk. He hit me with his little bomb deal. Okay. Uh, let's put another floor. And let's build all the way over here. I don't even mind if we use up all our, our flooring. Oh, okay. High ground. We got the achievement. Um, I'm not seeing any kind of... Oh, we're out of floors. Okay, are we... Do we have, like, a teleporter right by us? We have this one. You know what I'm going to do? I might just quickly pop back... Because it doesn't cost us anything to do this. I might just quickly teleport back to the base and build some more floors. Let's quickly do that. Let's grab... Go into this guy. And wooden floors. Let's build, like, 50 more of these guys. That should help. And is there anything else that we should be building up? I don't think so. I think, we, I think we're think we pretty well supplied. Um, I'm just going to quickly check the hearth, maybe. And make sure we at least have one of these. i got to make sure I use all this stuff, though, before we get in the fight. That's the uh, the big deal. Okay, we got the flingerang as well. Or fingerang? I don't know. I'm going to call it the flingerang. And we should be able to teleport back to... Oh, what did I click on? I don't even know. Okay, we yeah, that's exactly where I wanted to go. Good enough. Okay. Uh, where is the door to this sucker, though? Like, this is a door right here that we were able to build over to. I just don't understand how we get in. Wait a minute. What the heck? Are you kidding me? Uh, sometimes you feel dumb. All right, we're in here now. <laughs> Wampalax? What? Okay, fine. I guess we're... We're in a giant boss battle here. Yeah, that's right. Eat fire, sucker. Okay, this guy is big and nasty. Let's hit him with our butterfly sword and see how much damage this thing does. Oh, yeah, we actually hurt him. That's not bad at all. Okay, ooh, I love the speed boost, guys. Oh, this is good. This is good. Let's get him. Let's get him. Yeah, you think you're tough, don't you? Well, guess what? I think I'm tougher. I got better armor. I'm gonna kick you butt with a butterfly sword. Ooh, ouch. See? Okay. This is some impressively defended land. Looks like a freaking fortress. Uh, you had to choose a dang castle as the optimal comm relay placement? It's the highest point, and with that hastily constructed device, we'll need an extra edge. Uh, all the extra edge we can get. Even if that edge requires. Uh, we slay a series of enormous enraged beasts. I feel like I'm watching a horror film. Just go down the hallway. What's the worst that could happen? Plays creepy violin music. <laughs> you. Oh, man. Okay. Let's eat another one of these. Okay, we got another one of these nasties. Oh, I totally forgot we have this d guy. Okay, let's use this and see what happens. Okay, we're invincible. Oh, ho, ho, ho. seems like each one of these creatures defends a door. They, there can't be that many left. Dot dot dot. I get these. I get the feeling this is going to get worse. <laughs> Thirty second cooldown. Okay, well that's a thing. All right, we got a couple of these turtles. We should be able to handle it. Okay. Let's try and take this guy out. He should be dead pretty soon. Alright, he's dead. And let's flamethrower both of these guys if we can. No, we didn't get both. 
That's okay, we can take them one at a time. That might not be such a bad thing. Okay, we just avoid the fire and then ouch. Let's avoid that. Okay, another one down. Let's rock this guy. Kick his butt. Get him, Tari. Alright, let's do this. Get around him. We're doing okay, guys. We're not doing too bad. I think we can handle this. Let's just... Oh, dang. Okay, let's not get dead. Let's avoid getting dead. That's that's the goal, remember. Man, these guys hit hard. I really hope we can handle it. We're almost there. The highest point is just down this hallway. Let me guess. Let me guess. Don't tell me. It's going to be a Zug. A big, nasty Zug. Yep. There's one right there. Um, okay. This is it. Let me throw this com let me throw the common device down and we're in business. BS will. Hello, this is the Bureau of Shipping. We've reached uh you've reached Will. Oh man, it worked. Yes. Will, our ship was destroyed over the planet One Ope. <laughs> The Borgalax five star system in the Borgalax destroyed. Who destroyed a ship, a shipment, shipping ship? We're protected under the Universal Accord. We're not sure. Some alien calling himself Hugo Dugo. It's a long story, Will, which we. It's a long story, Will, which we'd love to tell you about, but we need a rescue team sent our way. You know, Bureau policy rescue will not be sent unless your shipment is intact. We have the packages, Will. All right, package rescue team has been dispatched and should arrive soonish. Oh my gosh, we're fighting Hugo Dugo. Um, I didn't even get to use all my buffs. Okay, do I just why why hello and welcome to my obstinacious abode, Flux. You live here? That's revealing. <laughs> Since, uh, silence, you mechanical child, child, children's toy. Hugo, we're just making a call so we can get off this planet and deliver our packages. We'll be gone no time if you just... It's Hugo Duco, and I think I would let you... And you think I would let you leave with those batteries? Ha! Huh. Batteries? These are packages, Hugo. Shut up! Shut it! I need those batteries. Give them to me. Um, okay, badness is happening. Oh goodness! Okay, let's let's hit him with our fire. Let's hit him with fire. Kick his butt! Kick his butt! Don't die! Name of the game. <laughs> oh my goodness! He has so much health. Oh, uh, okay. We are damaging him though. That's a thing. Oh, and we got a big nasty laser. Okay, big nasty laser time. I feel like I need to hit him with my flamethrower. Okay, let's hit him with a flamethrower. And let's use this bot. Just kick his butt. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. didn't see that coming, did ya? We gotta take advantage of this bot as much as we can because it only lasts for, it takes 30 or 40 seconds to recharge. Ow, okay, that's a long time. Um okay. It's having a little bit of an anger management issue. Get him with another bit of fire. Whack him in the face. Okay, more laser time. Uh okay, I can whack him between like the lasers as long as I don't get hit. This isn't too bad. Although the speed boost is actually almost hurting because the lasers are slow. Okay, let's hit him with fire. This isn't too bad, guys. I feel like we took more damage from the other guy. Um, oh, nasty lasers. Okay. What do you even need these batteries for? Surely you have some. You have more wherever you came from, and I have none. Seems only fair. Dang it, Hugo. These are just packages. We're under contract to deliver them. Oh, let's use this guy. Let's kick butt. Avoid death, kick butt. Okay, I'm always a little bit afraid. I wish there was some kind of thing telling us, like, when it was going to wear, wear off. Oh, okay, that didn't hurt us better than I thought. Not too bad. Okay, we're handling this. We're doing okay. We're doing okay. We got him halfway down, people. Halfway down. Kick his butt, Tari. I feel like he's Tari's doing most of the work, but I'm okay with that. Ouch. A little bit of pain. Let's avoid, let's avoid getting squished again. Ouch. Okay. Let's eat another one of those. Man, I need a little bit more speed here. Okay, let's hit him with more fire. Whack him in the face a few times. Come on. Oh, why are you lying? Why are you lying to me about this? Those are obviously batteries. Just hand them over. Uh, not gonna happen. Then I'll have to take them from you. Okay. Is that, is that your best is that your best option? I feel like we could work out something a little better. 
Let's not do the dying thing. Okay. Um, you're not really that hard, Hugo. I feel like you're the one that's gonna end up getting the raw end of this deal. Okay. Oh, ouch, ouch. Okay, that was a little bit of pain. Uh, fire. Uh, invincibility. Ah, you are meddlesome, though, wait. Uh, what are you doing? Why fight when I can just take them from you? Seriously, Hugo? These are not batteries. You and your lies. If you're just, um, if they're just packages, why are their energy levels so massive? It's just this, uh, Secure Corp packaging. 100% renewable and smells like fresh pine, too. Whatever, it's a tent. It's a tappable energy source containing enough power to warp an entire swarm to this planet. Swarm? Swarm of what? What? Nothing. Who said anything about a swarm? Him. I'll just take those batteries now. Yoink. What was that? Um, what was that commotion? Uh, nothing. Everything is totally fine. Nothing out of the ordinary just happened. <laughs> Do you still have the packages? Actually, that alien was super nice and we totally still have the packages no need to delay rescue or cut a pension excellent help us on the way alright juice box things are finally going our way What? and I was just about to say so glad the comm survived that fight all that work dot 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 flux focus Hugo has the packages and we have to get them back before rescue arrives right right any idea where he, he went not to worry. I've been, I've got advanced tracking on those bad boys. Beep, boop, boop, bop. Uh, spit it, spit it. Hugo seems to have warped to another part of the planet entirely. Crap. <laughs> Can you use the package cams to see what the place looks like? It's, it's really squishy. Nobody move, Grandmammy. Oh, my eyeballs. Flowery dear. Talk box. What are you two doing here? We just fought Hugo, but he fled before we could take him down, and my ears are ringing. Ringing with with the sound of glorious explosions. We got a, He got away, but our assault plan was perfect. Perfect! To be fair, you didn't tell us about this plan of yours, and we almost got him. Almost isn't close enough. I still have my vengeance. Where did he go? And uh, Any idea what part of the planet looks super squishy and gross? The bog? He went to the bog? Oh my, Flowery, I'm afraid Hugo has gone to a place we Tendrum avoid at all costs. The bog. It's a huge living organism that consumes the land it, gr it grew on. Strange, strange beasts live there. And them backstabbing Brubus? Uh, we need to get there. Those packages need us. So long as you getting them, packages means Hugo gets what he deserves. We'll help. We'll have to turn on the stone at the Creeping Rift. Okay, Creeping Rift. What does That doesn't sound like a nice place. Juice box. maybe we should just wait for rescue. Without the packages, they'll be so sc uh, scared, they're barely even sentient. You know my programming won't let me leave them. Uh, you'd leave me here too, just so that you could get rescued and then fired by the Bureau. Uh, point taken. To the creeping rift we go. We'll see you there, Grandmammy. Petty theft. New story. Okay. Wow. Well, that was crazy. Um, is there anything? Ooh, there's loot. All right. Well, guys, that was pretty interesting. Let's let's take these guys out. Let's see if we can get ourselves some good loot. Watching out. So I feel like these guys are gonna hurt way more. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> Yep, that happened. Let's take a look here. And see if I can't get back over here. Uh, yeah. Yep. I was like, I bet these guys are going to hurt a lot more than Hugo did. And I got one shot. Wow. Yeah. That's all I... I'm just... I'm pretty shocked at the moment. Uh, not really sure what to say about that. Let's just go get our stuff back. Oh man, I wonder if they'll attack us the moment we get in there. Hopefully not. Let's let's hope that doesn't happen. Okay, let's eat another one of these healing guys. And I burnt through quite a bit of the low grade ones. I have a lot of these stony health potions left, like 59. That's a lot. I don't think I need to be making any of those anytime soon. 
But man, this invincibility thing, it's pretty nice. It gives you the ability just to get in there and whack some face. Okay. Um, maybe if I just... Oh, dang. Okay. We gotta try not to die. That's the plan. Okay, let's get out of here. Maybe if we can just sick our guy on him. Uh, hello? Okay, they'll come over here. Alright. Uh... Kick his butt, Chari. Kick his butt. Get him. Okay, invincibility. Whack, whack, whack. And we're barely doing damage. Oh, snap. Okay, keep burning him. Keep burning him. Oh, goodness. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Running away. Oh, goodness. Okay, we need a little more space. I think that's that's part of it. Okay, let's get some space. And let's avoid the zappy things. Okay, avoid the zappy things. Do I have my invincibility yet back yet? Nope. Okay. Oh, man. These big ones, like, shock like crazy. They're always shooting these giant things out. Like, the little ones are a lot easier. Wow. Okay, we got one. That's the Zug Lug. So that's, like, the really, really big version. Uh, let's shoot him with this. And let's come over here and put the door up. Oh, 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 okay. Hold on. Let's put this door up. Can I, can I put the door up? I can't. Okay. I was thinking that might save us a little. Um, yep, avoiding the giant ball of death. That's that's the plan. Okay, watch out. Oh, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Don't die. Man, okay, that didn't hurt nearly as bad as the other time. That's weird. Okay, let's select this. Let's shoot him with it. Good. Keep kicking his butt, Tari. You just kick his butt, man. Just wreck it. Okay, let's go invincible and let's just start beating this knot out of him. Yeah. Oh, okay, we're not invincible anymore. That worked pretty good. But man, these guys are tough. Like, these guys are as tough as Hugo was. Shows you Hugo is more of like a big talker. Okay. There. We totally did it. Now the question is can we even get into this box? Uh, can I take that? Sure. Okay, and. Whoa. Harvest Bomb Mach 3. Cool. That That's worth it. So where's this new place? The Creeping Rift. Way down here. Huh. What are we at for time, guys? Oh, it looks like we're, we're out of time. Well, guys, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. That was a lot of fun, fighting Hugo. We just totally wrecked him. And we're going to be able to go to a new area, the bog. That's going to be sweet. So join us next time for that. I, I'm guessing we'll be able to get there next time, but not 100% sure. If you guys like the video, don't forget to hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. We'd love to have you as part of our community. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching, and we'll talk to you later.